The time was close to coming. His optimism gone. His smile and solid is gone. Remaining behind other. Oh my god, these birds are so well animated. They are. Yeah, this movie is really pretty. Yeah. Everything about this film is gorgeous. This is nice to come off Bandit Flare as well because that also just looks a lot worse than really. Yeah, than December Sky. I haven't seen it. Either of them actually. Oh, I gotta set my subtitles. Oh, that's a good thought. After this. <laughs> oh, okay, there we oh, go. God, the interlacing. Oh, interlacing. God, the quality. What? Sorry, the, no, the quality. Sorry, I, I misspoke. Okay. The quality. Oh God, even at 720, it doesn't look so good. I don't know. To me, it looks perfectly fine. Are you watching it, looks... it full screen? I'm watching with a tiny box. Screen. I think 1080 on the PS4. I only have up to 720. I can go down to 144 though. I can only click oh, 720. 144p? Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh my god. That's yeah. how you get coronavirus. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's how we time traveled. <laughs> if you go below 720p, so, wait, I, I, you are I guaranteed the to get coronavirus in two weeks. I missed the date. Was this 0079? It's a Yes, zero... this is during the one year war. This okay. is like right before the one year war starts. Yeah, yeah. because the colony drops. Because yeah. this is right before the Sydney gets oh, she's, yeah. the colony drops. She's, she's, she's having, yeah, she's having like that moment where Camille, where Camille had before the colony dropped from in Dublin, right? Yeah, and they basically yeah. warn everyone that the colony drops happening. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. At least it just showed you see double no, seven double nine. I'm behind, unfortunately. So yeah. No. No. So, yeah, colony drops. Two thousand. Drop yeah. looks really good. Oh god, it's such a good colony drop. <laughs> there is no such thing as a good colony drop. I'm sorry, Nick. Wow. No, okay. Fucking, I like co composition. Nick. Fuck. Uh, Nick, how could you say that? This is a horrible event. This is like a fucking. Oh, the compositing is so good. This is a super nuke, I'm sorry. Why are you like- Nick, why don't you have any sensitivity? Gosh! Look, That's if so you pretty. follow the rules of thirds, I don't care. <laughs> what the fuck oh, is Look how good this animation is! Nick fuck. loves his aesthetically pleasing disasters. Aesthetically pleasing genocide! Oh my god. Oh. There you go! Hey, I don't Nick. Think that's Someone quote Nick on Twitter. Hey. Check your mail. Don't worry, I'm, I'm recording this whole thing. Check your mail. Your Titan's badge is in the mail. Well, I'm cancelled now. It's over. <laughs> good games, everybody. Made some good posts, but... That's not getting you out of jail. God damn it. I've actually never seen this movie with the Japanese dub. Me either. I have never seen the English dub. I don't remember what language oh, we saw it in. The fucking Phoenix is like fucking Ghost Gundam. Yeah. I thought that was the Blue Destiny. It's both. The, 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 I mean, I mean, the Blue Destiny is kind of one sure of the most rehashed concepts. Really so. Yeah. Blue Destiny. Which one? Because two of those aren't Gundam stick. I said rehash concepts. Like the concept of Blue Destiny is rehash in a lot of UC side stories. That's all. Yeah. There's a lot of UC side stories. Yeah. There's a lot of UC side stories. Oh, the bitrate suddenly just shit the bed. <laughs> there are as many UC side stories as there are um, variants of Saber. <laughs> oh no. I think there might be more UC side stories. <laughs> Can I get War in the Pocket Alter? <laughs> is that the one with the happy ending? <laughs> exactly! Fuck. The one where war is good, actually. Oh no. The one where everyone has Christmas ham instead of eating hamburgers. The one where they just have Christmas together, maybe. Miserable throughout, and then suddenly a happy ending. Exactly! <laughs> this guy's not happy with this. Are you good with volume, or do I have to put this up higher, Holly? Fucking subtitles. I mean... 
yeah, no, it automatically like, okay. Yeah, cuz it's live. Yeah. Oh man, there's there's one scene that I'm waiting for and I'm just going to fucking giggle about it when it happens. And what scene is that? A scene that involves reused footage. Oh, oh. God, I just saw. I'm just going to laugh about the space suplex. <laughs> you don't understand? <laughs> God, I still haven't drawn fan out of that. I have drawn fan out of exactly one gun. What's the date in this right now? Sorry, I'm, I. Uh, you see 0097. Oh, it's, it's four years after Unicorn. Yes. No, it's. it's... Oh, just a year one? after Unicorn. I thought 0093 was fucking Unicorn. No, 0093 was a uh, Shards counterattack. Okay, I'm sorry. You're good. Oh, yeah, I see that. Oh, yeah, that is the date. Yeah, it's like the end of the year. Oh, yeah, it's the end of the year. Oh, yeah, it's the end why can't you just accept the Gundam universe as it is? Like, why must you contort it to fit your desires? I will punch you. <laughs> Psycho, <laughs> Psycho power is just time travel, Nick. Oh my yeah. god. I, okay, like, actually, I kind of like that detail, actually. Yeah, there, there actually has been a precedent of, like, uh, what is it, time manipulation? Or at the very least, like, time, space, um... How do I say this? Like, time space wiggliness? Yeah. Yeah! Being a uh, characteristic of this stuff. Like, I mean, beyond the time, beyond the time, wiggliness. All this, all this, like, really started in 0079 when Lala died and said, Ah, Amuro, Toki ga Mieru. Oh, fuck, I forgot her dad was a thing. Yeah. Yeah. I'm be real with you, her dad is a thing to her, but it's not the real thing thing. I thought she was an orphan. Yeah. So oh, did I. Let's orphans see, can have dads too. Right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> oh, God, the narrative is the such a RX-9. I'm surprised they didn't call it the RX-90 or like the Moo Gundam. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be the Moo Gundam. But there's already a Moon Gundam. No, Moo. Like the oh. Greek letter Moo. What, the fucking nothing Gundam? Yeah. The one that summons a pencil nope. is a 6C. Look, no, look, look, nobody wants to call it the fucking nothing Gundam. <laughs> I really did not believe this was like Martha Vist. Yeah, I was kind of surprised by how that turned out. Yeah, different she... character designers, man. Yeah. She just doesn't oh, look the same without her incredibly strong in jawline. <laughs> yeah! Ah, oh, fuck. Sawano's kicking in, I gotta Here turn go. it down! A Wait, what do you gotta turn it down? Just embrace the Sawano. Oh, that lighting. Why are there still fucking Zeons at this point in the fucking universe? Well, hang on. This is not Zeon, though. These are, these are DJ. Okay, fine. That's, it's in a Galgug. I don't care. No, it's, no, a, no, it's, it's DJ. DJ. It's from Zeta. Yeah. yeah, it's a Federation suit. Yeah. Okay, my bad. Yeah, well, it's not Galgug. Federation, it's Karaba. It's kind of a Federation suit. Yeah. Good. Remember, the Titans were using, like, a lot of Federation stuff. Oh, I'm losing my mind. A I lot forgot. of Zeon <laughs> stuff <laughs> had a, got turned into Federation <laughs> stuff, too. Wait, why are you losing your mind? I just forgot how good this animation is. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's been like a year and a half since I've seen this. Yeah. Yeah! Okay, my not favorite you. fucking scene is that dude just eating shit! He right, just eats shit! Step. You oh, just God. need the blood. Oh, my goodness. He is so confident that that Glock 
can just take out a fucking mobile suit? Yeah, I didn't. Oh. <laughs> this plot is moving fast. Oh, this plot is moving got him. very fast. Get ready for it to move faster. Well, all the Gundam movies have terrible pacing. I thought like Unicorns was fine. Well, Unicorns uh, was a movie. Well, Unicorns, Unicorns was like six movies! movies. Yeah. yeah. Meanwhile, look at F91! I think really the- I mean, look at Char's counterattack. <laughs> pacing issues only happen in the first, <laughs> like, a third of the movie. I think... Like, Gundam like... movies should not be a thing. I kind of agree, actually. It just never works, unless it's G-Savior, as I laugh nah, at I, Oh my god. So wait, Yo. I disagree. For all its issues, I still love CCA. I'm so... Okay, well, so, really by the way, so this is a few, wait, a few wait, 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 months... Wait, 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 I'm so fucking... What just happened there? Like, he's like... So we just jumped a few weeks, and now we're in, we're in space. We're chasing after Phoenix. What? Yeah. We're following what, 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 a group what, what, that's what's, unrelated. What's the phoenix? Why is the phoenix here? Who's Don't you remember that one bonus episode from Unicorn? No. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Did I have to watch a bonus episode? Look, of we're chasing there. a bird. That's all you gotta know for now. <laughs> Did I have to watch that one bonus episode of the Unicorn no, you don't. anime? We're just chasing a bird. That's all you well, have I mean, to know for now. I mean, they just said that this was the third Unicorn model. Yeah. Yeah. And that yeah. they had discovered that it was flying through space. Yeah. Yeah. The thing is, someone like, has stolen the third. It's hard when you're all yelling. I'm sorry. Sorry. Like, whispers after you're good, Arisa. That's why I was like, Shit, I just missed something important. <laughs> it moves fast. Oh, they got the unicorn. <laughs> unicorn no today. Brother, Avengers. Fucking girls. I was trying to oh fuck, the best track in the whole movie. Oh, I love this track so much. Just fuck it. It's like the only good track. So. Headphone users, I implore you to turn up the volume. Doing so now. I'm not, I don't have headphones. My headphones make me sound like a robot, apparently. Wow. Oh, lighting. The hyper mega cannon is also his dick. Yes. Who is that who said to turn up? Yes. Okay, so this is Gundam narrative. A pack. A pack. And it represents the first third of the movie, where the pacing is so frenetic, it causes friction everywhere. <laughs> See, it represents the first third of the narrative. Oh my god. I also hope you can appreciate the entire plot being the lyrics of this song. I can't yeah. hear the lyrics of the song because people- Don't worry about, about it. it. Yeah. Tess, did you have this much trivia in your brain going through it when we watched this the first time? <laughs> no. I just wanted to know what was going on, and then after I watched it like two more times, then it's like, Oh, that's how it is. Why did I you see that the writing movie? of this movie is done by Hands of Ham. Okay, so my my Okay, so my I have another question. Like uh -huh. like the thing before where the guy had a flashback about how that that the girl I assume who's telling him what to do now yeah like and they actually put the big fucking piece of shit full narrative in the game <laughs> he just starts in like a fucking meteor mode they were crazy during the maxi days they would have done it no I I. God, I hope all the stupid enemy modes are somehow. Available. Never mind. I think I figured it out. I think I figured okay. it out. Never mind. Sorry. The 
feds are a lot of fucking new types to use, except for this bitch, right? Uh, I think that'll become pretty clear. I don't think they're yeah. actually Federation affiliated, are they? Oh, you're right, I guess. I don't know. I can't remember. I don't know, I just assume if they have a Gundam, they're feddies. Well, okay, so... They'll explain it later on in the movie. Yeah, I give this movie a lot of shit, but I feel like it explains itself pretty well for the most part. Okay, wait, those other guys are Fetties though, right? Yeah. yeah, they are Fetties. They're just a different division. <laughs> Look, if you aren't second-guessing wondering whose side is on what, is it really a Gundam thing? That's true. And the entire time I was watching this movie, I had I did not care at all who was on what side because I just I was like, you know. Okay, what? but you are also like not invested in the whole like Gundam <laughs> mythology because like. You're right. <laughs> Can't wait to be surprised by new Maxi all exclusive suit. Phoenix and that fucking grown so loud. And if it's not a part of my agenda, I'm for my worried. next life, I hope to get. I have to be a bird. Okay. Yeah. That looks a lot like the Double Zeta High Mega Cannon. It does. Yeah. Uh, it's basically the exact same type of design, it's just on his dick instead of on his yeah. head. Yeah. It's also yeah. on his dick too, and it's the same design. Yeah. It's the Monogon Bakaru. Char Aznable Ooh. only accepted the dick cannon. Sleeves remnants? This is some big politics. Yeah, yeah there are the there remnants of remnants of remnants of sleep. Oh god, Miniv's in this politics. fucking movie. What the fuck? Only briefly, don't no worry. Politics. Yeah! Briefly. They got, politics. they got a tease unicorn too. Yeah. You mean Hathaway's Flash? <laughs> no, that's gonna be something else. They can't possibly fucking try to fucking put this shit into Hathaway's Flash. Mmm, politics. Thank you, mm, politics. Benazir, it's time for your 4pm dick flattening. <laughs> <laughs> no. Why is it every time I try try to put a bite of salad in my mouth, somebody says something about pink? Were there novels of this, or did it just fucking exist? I'm gonna die. There was a novel of this, okay, okay. but the narrative Gundam was new to the animation. It's kind of like Banshee's extra armaments. Yeah, because I know that Phoenix was in, like, a weird unicorn novel. Yeah. So, in the novel, um, Yona pilots a Stark Jagan. Mmm. That would have made more sense. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but then we would miss this. him in the giant pillow armor. Yeah. But then they wouldn't have had a Gundam to name the show after, and they knew they had to sell Plamo. Yeah. Let me put it this way, though. If we had the Stark Jagan, we wouldn't have the big cannon. But, but Jagans are cool! Yeah, but Jagans don't have dick cannon. Yeah, you can give a Jagan a dick cannon? Yeah, the power of gunpla. It's unlimited. I'm four for four for sticking, like, lettuce in my mouth. At the mention of... Also, they don't give us a narrative master grade, so it's bullshit. They eventually yes, will. The pillow suit! Yeah, the Pillsbury Doughboy. <laughs> oh. Barry, are you gonna do fair Look how comfy Yona is. I already have. Yeah. The epitome of comfy. He looks like he's about to throw up. Well, yeah, the epitome of comfy. Oh, if you're not about to throw up, are you really comfy? That's uh, real heavy. <laughs> in space. Look at this guy. Oh, this guy's a badass. You can tell by his eyebrows. He looks like the yeah. dude from Build Fighters Try, aged like 40 years. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized that, and that feels like cursed fucking knowledge. Gotta take its dick off and fire the high mega cannon. Yeah. A single shot mobile suit, if you would. It's not the size, it's how you use it. Damn. My guy has fucking horns, what the fuck? Do you oh, like this parallel? Arm, arm, arm. Oh, this is like one of Do my favorite. Like leg, leg, leg. 
Backpack. Justin, Justin, I think in the movie you like predicted that this was gonna happen, right? Like. No, I didn't. No, I thought you did. I thought you made a comment. You no, like, I didn't. Oh, I thought so. So, oh man. Okay, look. Just because the Gundam is named Narrative Gundam, I would not. I did not think that they would like use the Narrative Gundam to actually portray the narrative. <laughs> yes, what? what? That's not what? what I meant. But okay. The what? What? Mac. Capitalism is angry. Oh shit. Brain mm -hmm. slap. There we go. Now it's a real Gundam show. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, you just walk into the room and Bernie <laughs> Sanders DPs on wake up. <laughs> <laughs> what? What do you do? You like, punish him. I'll, no. No, you can't block you Bernie Sanders. It. He knows when to DP. It. You just take oh it. Can I burst? I know Bernie Sanders. Well, then you wasted your burst and you're back to neutral. No, the, bur and the DP leads to death on counter hit. But Bernie Sanders will RC the DP and then throw your bird. That's fine, I'm not dead. Someone's got some echo going on. I'm sorry, that's me. We forgive you. You're all good. I, I had to double check to make sure it wasn't me, oh god. <laughs> I'm trying to hear the movie, but at the same time, I'm trying to not let it feed Someone's got issues. Microphone. So it's very difficult, actually. <laughs> so, like, yeah, uh, just tone down to, like, the volume of your headset or microphone. I don't have a head... I don't... Use the headset. Push the talk, there you go. Yeah, push the talk. We had this discussion... Question with Breaker. I sound like a robot with the headset on. Oh, We're accepting of all robots here. Yeah. I mean, uh, especially the skeletal ones. Oh, that's Breaker a Neo Zeong. Oh, fuck, here we go! That's a Neo Zeong. God, can we not? No, not this thing again. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hang on. He's actually not a bad villain, but I do like the term uh, K pop full frontal. K pop full frontal is my I fucking man. He's the Darth Maul of the Gundam <laughs> franchise. Why are still Neo Zeong around? Oh, oh no, these are these are sleeves. This is Neo Zeong. Yeah. Oh Neo yeah. By the way, Erisa, did you know that there's actually another Sinanju around? Did you know that there's actually another Neo Zeong around? Uh... Did you know that when Full Frontal hijacked the Sinanju, he actually stole two Sinanjus? Instead of just one. <laughs> GTMF, I'm going to drive to no. Texas. To <laughs> no, if you do on. not stop. Erisa, if you do it, I mean, sorry, that's not Erisa. My bad. I have no idea who's talking right now. Nick. One Nick, of those. If, if you listen, Nick, if you drive to Texas and you body this man, I will buy you dinner. Oh fuck. This <laughs> is. <laughs> Also, hold up. The best scene is coming up right now. Look! The old Zeta Gundam footage just oh, playing shit. on the monitor in the back! Oh, I remember that. It's just like when they play the fucking CCA footage. Yeah. When they play the CCA footage in Unicorn. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. I'm like maybe like 10 seconds behind everybody. Yeah. That's fine. This is Bell Torture, right? I think so. No, that's a. Uh... Uh, Luo, uh, what is it? That's the lady, Stephanie Luo. Oh, I don't remember. Wow, it's, 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 it's... She's from like the first Earth episodes, uh, where the Audumla stopped by Hong Kong, and then uh, Camille met four for the first time. Uh, wow, I don't remember. Was that before or after Camille got his shit kicked in? Uh, that's after. Okay. Also, I just remember this... Wong kicking yeah. his shit in. Oh boy, so, so like this is basically- Okay, so I, I get this now. So narrative is basically them going like, you know what? We didn't stop by enough fucking things on the fucking member berry trip the Unicorn did. We need to revisit all the other things we didn't talk about. You know, yes. like remember this thing from Zayder? Remember these yeah. things from- from so Zayder? Like, hey Nick. Yeah? Do you remember when, um... Oh god, I forgot his name. Wong tested out the whole last Tekken. Oh uh, god, oh fuck, Hong I forgot Hong about- Hong Oh god! Oh yeah, this too. What the fuck? 
Well, that doesn't sound good. Uh, cyber uh... new type that went nuts. Are you okay, friend? Do you need a Tylenol? I think we're gonna need maybe like six of those at least. Maybe an Advil? Some ice cream? She got Extended. better. Extended Some Advil flavored ice cream? And NyQuil chicken. Okay, like, like, okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna come on with a hot take personally at this point. I'm okay with them making a thing of saying, hey, guess what? The, the Federation side when you're broken was really, really fucked up. Like, I'm okay with it if, if that's mostly with this movie. I don't even think that's a hot take. take. I think that's one of the better parts of this movie. Yeah. Because like they, did, they, they had not leaned into that enough, and you see stuff of like, hey, you know what? That so. Was really that footage was when uh, Zero Three went nuts, and uh, it also dunked on oh, Banshee. And Dunk that's what Banshee? that's why you Banshee see? has the gold collar. It originally has a black collar, but uh, oh, the gold collar was when it was damaged when Zero Three went nuts. Yeah, that, that was basically the bonus episode there. Yeah. Tesh, where do you get all this trivia from? Like, where do you store it at? In Brain. This girl looks this like is a nerd. I'm a nerd, yeah. Uh, that that I woman know, looks like that woman from Thunderbolt. It's just like readily available. I'm like, how do you remember all of this at one time? They're not the same though. They're not the same. <laughs> uh, the characters from Thunderbolt and this. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Wait, this character it's my boy, K-pop Full Frontal in the house. K-pop Full Frontal. I don't. Know. I love his voice actor. So is this, this guy's like a failed full funnel clone, right? Yeah. It's like once you get a good look at his face, Holly will immediately realize why I like them. <laughs> God. Destiny did it first with the slashes over the eyes. Sorry, Nick. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I also like the Destiny, so fuck off! It actually pained me a bit when I actually got like a close-up look at his face, and I was like, oh no. They're tears! Is he a clown? Oh, no. Clowns have that thing. Oh man. Fitting because he is a clown. Okay, okay so, so, so... <sighs> So the Phoenix has been basically at large just flying around in the fucking asteroid belt for like how, yeah. many, for like how many fucking years now? Yeah. Uh, a little less than one. Yes. Okay. Because I think it happened like right after the events of Unicorn? Big chillin'. Uh, it happened right no, before. No, it happened before. Unicorn. Yeah. Ah. It's been just fucking big chillin', but then like yeah. Unicorn events made it like... Go nuts. Sure. Well, for an unknown reason, it is back in the Earth's sphere. Okay. Yes. I don't actually remember what that reason is. I don't remember. Well, it's a good thing you've been watching the movie. <laughs> yeah, it'll become clear. Yes. I'm very focused on my college. Yeah. Man, we've already had the Gundam shot where they start fighting as streaks of light, so I need- I, I don't even need to watch anymore. That's the epitome of any Gundam project. <laughs> also, spoilers. Juna isn't yeah, actually very good at fighting. I mean, I, I, I kind of figured. <laughs> That's why they why? gave him the suit. Yeah, I, don't, I don't like Juna yeah. very much. He's not very useful. I'm not gonna lie. Also, he I doesn't like even have the funnels. He's Oops. got incoms. Yeah. Those are better than funnels. See, if this was split to it, he'd be covered in pink ink. They might be better than funnels if you're not a new fight. <sighs> I mean, have you seen this man in EX vs 2? He fucks. I actually have. <laughs> From what I saw, he fucks. He gets no poon. No, he totally fucks. Every... Ho hum Federation officer. I can't eat my shark. Call it in peace. Oh, slam that wall. At the very. Yeah, that's a. What a Gundam Kabe. Kabe Don! Oh! I mean, at the very least, like. Oh my god, a real Kabe Don. <laughs> Oh my god, you're right. Yoda, please. 
Man, this is like, this is a weird experience because all of you are watching it like at the same time and I'm like 10 seconds behind all of you. I'm behind, I'm behind them too. I'm behind them too. I'm so like, I'm going through then. So like they're making a commentary and I'm like, oh no, I can't wait to see what's coming. Exactly. <laughs> Um, at the very least, like, Jonah is kind of decent with spatial awareness because he did intentionally step on a mobile suit's head while he was evading fire. Oh, uh, Jonah? Uh, when he was Jonah in the DJ. Jonah cut his teeth while playing Fortnite. Oh my god. <laughs> his spatial awareness is godlike. <laughs> is he gonna ride on a rocket? Is that what I'm gonna see? Oh yeah, here's the Sinanju. Uh, I'm it's sorry, like Nanju Stein. Yeah, yeah. By speedrunning Breath of the Wild and playing Fortnite. I think is the Stein like the beta version? Yes. Uh, it was the like version the that made by Anaheim, based off uh, New Gundam's data. Yeah, but this that and... was the yeah. Like I thought they fucking took. I thought this Nanju the, the full frontal stole the Stein and they turned it into the fucking. Sinanji. You are correct. Oh no. So You're what correct. ended up happening? is they retconned it to where before Full Frontal stole the Sinanju Stein, and then they changed it into the Sinanju. But then they retconned it to where he stole two Sinanju Steins! There was one that they left unmodified, and one that they turned into the regular I, Sinanju that you see so that the sleeves use. Because it's fucking it stupid! How did they what? How did he still tear it once? How can he pass He stole two Sinanjus well, because his dick is that he big! Stole two. Yeah, if you okay. hijack <laughs> the, the shipping container, <laughs> yeah, two true, fall out. Yeah. It's like when yeah. two things fall out of the vending machine. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Pretty much! He just happened to roll two Sananju Steins in one gotcha. I just want, like, fucking full frontal watching a video of no, Gato going, oh, damn, really? He just just walking in? in. Alright. One with one hook and he just nice. walked in! It's when full frontal did a- Yeah, he did a- <laughs> Dude, he did a 10 roll and he just got two Sananju Steins. Okay. Oh god! That, that, that means they're definitely gonna fire weapons in this colony now that they. Yeah. <laughs> <They're definitely, laughs> they are definitely going to fuck shit up in this colony. Just it's like you know. Foreshadowing. <laughs> All right, find the best places. Gee, I sure hope it doesn't turn into Heliopolis. You know what I was saying earlier about real. You know what I said earlier about very well composited genocide? I'm gonna get another drink now. <laughs> this would have definitely made more sense if he wasn't piloting a fucking gun. When you see a colony, you expect like a whole bunch of people to fucking die. Right? There it is. The board. I'm like, hello. I don't know. It's the Yeah, but they gotta get the Fenix. Oh hey, Sinanju. Hey. Oh, I thought we were saying hey to Jamal. I was saying hey to Jamal. Hello. What's up, Jamal? How you doing, man? Hey. We're watching NT. Yeah. Oh, they actually gave us the fucking. Yeah, it has a rifle similar to High New Gundam's. Uh, yeah, not High New, I'm sorry, not High New. Actually, it is kind of High New Gundam's rifle. Uh, too, too late for that, Chief. Oh, that reused unicorn soundtrack. Yeah. Unicorn soundtrack was alright. I love it. It was it was You're probably like right. I just oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, they just got ruined. Wow. Oh. People are dying and you're laughing. <laughs> yeah. It was just so <laughs> sorry. <laughs> space though. It was just I got nowhere. <laughs> All right, what was that about people dying? I'm feeling the same way about that as I watched the fucking seed microwave. All right, <laughs> where I'm just like, this is supposed to be terrible. Oh, 
and I just can't take it fucking Wait, seriously. Wait, I go frame got banned? <laughs> uh, I imagine so. I think that might have been a plot point in Unicorn. Yeah, they, they, that was a plot point at the end yeah. of the Unicorn. Because Axe's so. shock was kind of a big Yeah. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Char. <laughs> Well, I mean, like, canonically, it was actually supposed to be banned after the new fucking new Char, but then they had the, yeah. like, Unicorn thing, and then they could stand up and basically being banned after the Unicorn. Also, income sucks. Facts. My spider sense is tingling! By the way, do you like how the Fenex is just, like, perching? Like a real bird. Yeah? Nope. I love it. It's dumb as shit. Oh my god! K pop will box me! K pop full frontal has self esteem issues. K pop full frontal needs to fucking chill, dude. Does the fat suit have psycho frame on it? Which fat suit? Did you guys call him K pop full frontal? Yeah. Yeah? I think the narrative has Psycho Frame in it. No, no, the Jonah fat suit. The one he's wearing inside the cockpit. The Jonah fat suit? Oh yeah, the fat suit actually does have Psycho Frame parts on it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. Like, I, I was like, this guy is shit, so he's probably literally wearing stuff that augments his fucking power, because he's literally wearing a fucking Psycho Frame suit. That's what Pretty I mean. much. Oh my god, it's I remember Mike. this episode of Double O Gundam. <laughs> I remember this uh, shot from Gundam Build Fighters Try. Hey, it was that too. Will K-pop full frontal shout the attack names though? No, he's just gonna be insecure again. <laughs> God. God. Do you know why is he just Gundam Darth Maul? <laughs> I don't have enough Psycho Frame to fight this piece of shit. I actually like how the Fenix looks. Yeah, I like how the I Fenix cannot stand cool. the plumes on the back. It's just like the whip. Oh, blue and so orange. When does this take place? What does narrative take place? After you know. Uh, narrative takes place uh, 0097, like a year after Unicorn. Okay. It's like 0079, Boy. you can just swap the numbers around. Boy, I can't wait until, like... I, I can't wait until they show our eyes at the end of the movie. Oh boy. Wait, what? What? Ah. When are we getting 0069? Nice. <laughs> nice. Oh, here we go, baby! <laughs> nice. NTD! New Time Destroyer! Yeah. No, the suit's here. Yeah. New type destroyer. New type destroyer. Unicorn type is the same as the same system. The narrative of Gundam was So did the fucking Jake and he was in have a fucking NTD as well? I actually have no idea. I didn't know that far and they're not. I didn't actually uh, read the actual novel itself. Well, test. That means we're just gonna have to do a dramatic reading of the novel at the next oh tournament. Oh my god! Two together. <laughs> That'll be fun. And then we'll read also all of the weird nightclub scene in the unicorn novel. Oh no! Where People everyone will be able to conquer death. Itself. Everyone's oh. eating edibles and smoking weed and having sex. And Benazir wants none of it. Oh my god. Banazer wants fucking none of it. God, why is Fukuda like so awful at like... Oh god. We'll just oh, do god, a live is, reading at the next getting... tournament we go to. You know, yeah. like, okay, okay, like this I'm like blessed at. Like, I'm okay with the idea of like going into like, oh well, like the fucking 
fucking unicorn manipulated time or whatever, but I'm less interested in going. No, we've scientifically deducted the new types are literally on a planet dimension where they transcend time and talk to souls in, in either of time or whatever. I'm less cool with that. I just like new types' powers being empathy is yeah, cool. Yeah. Agree. Oh, I reveal. Oh, it did it have to Oh, he said the Y word. Oh no. Damn, bitch. <laughs> hey, if you look down, you can see Amaro's dad being sucked into space. Oh no. <laughs> Beyond oh, the Oh Jesus, that dude just got hit by the car. Beyond the time, why is there a new? Why is there a new? Why did they make a second Neo Zeo? Uh, yo, that did that did get hit by a car. It existed before, like, yeah. Oh fuck! But why would they do that? What's the point? And narrative gun to be like, it actually existed before the uh, what is it? I like how narrative gun to be like the edible ain't shit. <laughs> <laughs> Like, as far as I remember, wasn't the whole oh. point of the Neo ZL was, it was, it was for the Beyond the Time shit? It's By the so way, Aaron, I have a spoiler for you. <laughs> the NT in the movie title doesn't actually stand for narrative, it stands for NTR. I thought it stood for <laughs> new type. Okay. What the fuck? Up? Yeah, new type revenge, right? <laughs> oh, so that's what that stands for. <laughs> Oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so lost. No, Yona's big dick energy is so massive that he sees the Neo Zeong and he's like, You made this? I made <laughs> this. <laughs> oh god, the child's kind of Oh, wow. Look at that. And K pop full front. Wait, is that guy Yoda from the is? fucking. Yeah, he was, uh, he's one of the yes. pilots that helped to try to push Axis. Oh. Shit. I didn't know that. The Blue Destiny pilot is one He's of like, the oh no! He's like, oh no, not again! At this point, <laughs> at this point I'm half surprised that Yu Kajima hasn't showed up in, in this yet. Am I back? Can you hear me? Yes. yes. Welcome back. Oh, no. It baby. Somebody, something happened to the Transformer up the street, and then I had to fight with my internet. <laughs> Oh no. Look, it's gonna be Sydney, Australia in like two years. Oh no. Oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> Just Australia, what's the worst that can happen? Okay. Oh wait. Although personally, I feel like if there's any place on Earth that's gonna get colony dropped, it's gonna be Florida. If we could, yeah, be no, so definitely. Fortunate. God damn! <laughs> damn. Bugs Bunny was right. Hashtag. <laughs> <laughs> Bugs Bunny Colony drops Florida done it before. <laughs> yeah, your souls are weighed down by your gravity. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if only I had a carrot. God damn it. Show is that from? I feel like I should remember and I don't. Bugs Bunny or Souls Rumble being weighed down by gravity? Souls being weighed down? I know what Bugs Bunny is. I mean, that's what Shars kind of is. That's like Zeon. Yeah, that's what Shars kind of is. But that's like Zeon's whole thing. Neo Zeon. Yeah. yeah. The whole thing is like Souls being weighed down by gravity. Yeah. That was also a line in uh, Unicorn as well.
People are dying, no let it happen. I was just about to say, people are dead, dude. <laughs> this, is exactly, this, is, this is exactly why fucking Psycho Frame was fucking banned. So this, this I was about to say, happens. right, this is why Psycho Frame was banned. And then they're just like, you know what, let's bring it out again. Thanks, Char. Oops. Jesus fucking Christ. Same。ビッグ、Wait。Titans are still. Well, when do you mean Titans? Well, this is like uh, this is a flashback to like. Uh, this is a flashback to around to around Zeta. Yeah. Like the end. Okay. Yeah. This is. Uh, okay. 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 That's what I was about to say. I was confused. I was like, hold on. Are we still in the flash? This movie sort of switches back and forth. Yeah. And if you haven't seen like the very very beginning, it just sort of assumes that you will keep up. Yeah, yeah, uh, I missed like 30 minutes, so... Yeah, that is understandable. Meanwhile, NTR... Oh my fucking god. <laughs> like, jeez, this is actually... Dude, this is actually... I didn't think I was gonna say this, but like, this is actually possibly, like, worse than the fucking... Uh, uh, than what the fucking uh, cosmic era fetties did. Yikes. God, Yona has the personality of like bread that I put in the fucking Sonic the Hedgehog toaster. He does. <laughs> I, I don't know how I feel about that. No, uh, what is it? You're right. And I'll explain why in the end of the movie. I know why. I'm not gonna say it, but I know why. Man, y'all have some tiny ass fucking eyebrows. Yeah, the Titans shave them off regularly. Damn. It's part of their new type conditioning. I didn't know that you had to go and Super they, Saiyan and then, 3. And then they don't take her away and they put Honda in life, don't they? Instead, don't they? Yeah. Does Does that mean that Mugi is a new type? Yeah. Oh, fuck. What's up, bitch? The I'm selling out my friend's shading on her face. Jesus fucking Christ. No, you I'm doing my part. <laughs> <laughs> them to just, like, no, don't start crying out, bitch, you fucking asshole. <laughs> Yo, I'd like like to tackle you, Yona. <laughs> Have you ever gotten to tackle a child before? It's it's riveting. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Have you ever got to beat up a child? No, just got the oh, punch no, of kid. my lips. These are titans. They probably get in fist fights with kids all the time. Yeah. <laughs> Jared Messa did nothing wrong, got to Yeah. Right. Jared Messa was right this whole time. <laughs> God. Fuck them kids. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Going oh, through like, Dynasty yeah. Warriors Gundam, you yeah, find out that's the best Sorry, version of Zeta Gundam. Because oh god! <laughs> Oof. Usosuke. Oh yeah, that's right. She was an actual new type. Yeah. But that they made her a cyber new type, so she became yeah. new type times two. About, so she's a super new type. Oh no! A new type beyond new types. Meanwhile, I never realized that K-pop Full Frontal's eye began to glow. 
Bro, where Did have you, you not been? notice? <laughs> You already had TR'd him, you've done enough. <laughs> Why is Kate possible frontals eye going like he got a GS or something? Because he because, he's getting, because he gets a hard he's that on dude from when people Ropa die. Too. He's yeah. Tanaka Gundam. Ito? He's not Ito? No, he's Tanaka Gundam. Oh, okay. Oh That's even worse. He's literally <laughs> That is think... even worse. Literally, look at the motherfucker! He's Tanaka Gundam! He is, actually. He I, is. I have no, he, the resemblance now. He is. That's he has actually kind of disturbing. Energy. He just needs to be surrounded by squirrels. What, weren't they gerbils? It was like everything. He just had all the animals. Are you talking about Lord of the Rings? I'm talking about Danganronpa. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> There's a character well, named Gundam. Let's just like leave this fucking that... destroyed, abandoned. Oh, yeah, I, vaguely remember, I don't actually remember a lot of Duncan Rob because it wasn't very memorable for me. But... There's something that shouldn't exist in this world. And he <laughs> immediately <laughs> fucks off! Okay, yeah, like, I think, okay, I, this movie's pacing is terrible, but I think I followed the plot pretty well. So. Yeah, I was, gonna, yeah, I was just about to say, like, I know I'm 30 minutes, like, late, but, like, I feel like the pacing is off. The pacing's very off. Like, I can't I understand think, what's exactly going on. I don't think, though, if you watch the movie from start to finish, you have trouble catching anything, though. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like I wouldn't have trouble catching up, like, what's going on. But I yeah, still feel like start, the pace is just off. You'll be, you'll be aware of what's going on the entire time. There's Yo, two, he's about to catch two. Oh. Oh. Like, like J Jamal, I can tell you that, and like going into this movie, I had seen maybe like five oh. that I don't like half paid attention to, and I was able to follow like basically the entire Yeah, like I think the biggest yeah. problem with this is... Yeah, I know, Unicorn's the, got a better pace. Yeah, like, I, th I think, like, the biggest problem with this is that they're so insistent on trying to tie it into, like, all aspects of fucking Gundam history, because, like, ooh, remember that? Remember this? That, like, it kind of just... Like, yeah, that's kind of... Meanwhile! Yeah, I was gonna say, that's kind of how I feel. Zeta I was like, hey, guys, Australia. Look how bad it is. It's my boy! Oh, it's my boy! It's my son! Shit. It's my boy. <laughs> it's like my it. it's my boy. I like, I like, yeah, I'm not I'm not happy with this either. Like the like the try to like let's just try to demystify everything about me. Oh my god, the 0079 footage. I like that some of this like it's the Zeta footage from the movie. So some of it is like high def and some of it is not. <laughs> he just switches back to the cells what? and they just crawl. I'm just glad I I'm just glad you could just see Shiroko get stabbed once again. <laughs> Yo, exactly. Camille's goddamn Giga Drill Breaker. <laughs> no, for real. Hey, Shiroko, I'm gonna put this whole ass Gundam inside your guts. You ready? <laughs> I liked it when it's not fucking trying to explain everything, though. Yeah. That's how I kind of feel. They're doing a lot of telling and not a lot of showing, is how I feel. I, I, yeah, like, I, I, the attacks are supposed to kind of be, like, weird and not yeah, they're, shit. Like, they're kind of just, they kind of just get it, you know? That's kind of how it's always been with Zintai. Honestly, I'm kind they of okay it. with it, if only because, like... Fact oh, are you a, is, are you a fucking metachlorian apologist? Fact fact of the matter is, <laughs> they're using this to tie it into like the story as uh, what is it to the movie story as a whole, and they only got an hour and thirty minutes. Oh, it's called Gundam narrative, but they followed the narrative. It's called narrative because they do a lot of narrating. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I love it when a whole ass gun is just so surprised. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Listen, Nick. Nick, I put that in chat for one specific person and I guarantee he's not looking at the it, it works, but we don't understand why it works. I really don't like that ass. Oh my god, he built it using- Now they're trying to fucking inject it. 
Now, now they're literally trying to fucking inject the like the we can't explain it bullshit back into it right after they tried to explain it all the way. I'm like, oh, come on, guys, you gotta pick one. Can you just inject the Zeta into my gut? <laughs> I really want to relate the, to Shiroko. Plow my guts right now. <laughs> just spread my guts <laughs> open, Camille. Give me your, give me your big red, red hot fucking Zeta. Oh, Camille. <laughs> Do your super directly into my bottom intestines. Oh, oh, Camille, it's not the same unless we both go to together. <laughs> if you break my spine, I'll break your mind. Oh my god. Guys. <laughs> Like, this, this is like, like this is like shit. I feel like every single person there should be in like you're fucking crazy, but they're all just like, yeah. I've seen some shit now. I believe it. X is shock, right? Uh, but we've gotten to the point now where K-pop full fr God, what the fuck is his actual name? I fucking forgot. Zoltan. Zoltan. Zoltan? Zoltan. Zoltan. That's such a shitty name. I mean, you have a better name, sir. Yeah, K-pop full frontal. It's a pretty good name. <laughs> yeah. I don't know about that. I mean, I'd probably post fan cams of him. He's pretty great. He probably no, no, does no, not you. Sorry, I was just taking what she what she was saying. Like, like that. Like, if we didn't die, then all these shitty things would happen. I'm like, I'm not sure about that one. Like, yeah, I don't know about that, Chief. R.I.P. Jack. Ah. Oh. oh no! You can hop in his car. <laughs> He'll just hop into the climax of Gundam narrative in his fucking car. Yeah, man. I don't get him wrong. <laughs> All of a sudden, his car did, just gets new type time traveled out of existence. <laughs> oh god, the truth. And he just fucking flies out of the driver's seat. I don't. Wait, no. Riddy's not in this movie. Yeah, Riddy is, I don't think, in the movie. That's what I thought. No. <laughs> Oh, I love him so much. He's like the best character in this movie. <laughs> but he does nothing. Listen, why do you want this one white man? Goodbye person that looked like she was that one character from Thunderbolt. Why does he have horns? Yo, am I gonna have to make Riddy and Zoltan fan cams? Yo. Oh my god. Bro, That's up to you. <laughs> don't. Oh my god, he does have horns. Do it. Do it, you have the power. Oh, I know I have the power. I thought, I thought like, all you, like Gundams in Unicorn had horns because, like, it's called Unicorn and, like, that's supposed to be, like, the number one, right? And it's der derived from Unicorn, right? So it's gotta have a horn. Yeah? Yeah? yeah. But it's the RX-0, not the RX-1. Right? Listen, man. I don't know that much Gundam canon. I'm only using what I can do. I'm sorry. My my knowledge of Gundam canon revolved like solely around. <laughs> no, that <laughs> Feels bad. How many people even <laughs> fucking get to retire as being fucking pilots in this fucking year? She was like imagine three days in retirement. Imagine. Well, at this point, it's already too late, like... The narrative has already gotten to take first dibs. Man. Sloppy this seconds. Is bothering me the oh god, you actually <laughs> said it. You said it, not me. Right? Give my fucking floating death machine. Give me my two bazookas. It's bothering me the entire... Like, somebody, somebody mentioned Akito, right? From, like, Akito the Exile. Nothing good will come from forcing it. Yes. <laughs> Why are the fucking, like, two random fucking naturals having the most insightful conversation about this shit? Yo, can we... Let's just watch Gundam Seed. No. I just no. wanna watch that one uh, scene like, where... What's-his-face just gets decapitated out of the cockpit. After watching it again, it's way too few and far between to have the moments that they're fucking... Shot bustingly terrible. No, I know. I watched it like a year ago. Don't they show that scene of what's his name getting shielded oh, like six times? 
They show it a lot. Oh, they show that scene a lot, but it's like my favorite scene in Seed. I swear they show it like twice in some episodes. Yeah. <laughs> Look, they gotta get the point across that this man got fucking decapitated because they probably spent a whole twenty dollars on those frames. Yeah, but oh like Nicola got cut in half. You only see that once. No, they you see that more than once. Really? Yeah. I think my fa one of my favorite renditions is they do that scene in Dynasty Warriors Gundam 2. <laughs> it's really bad. <laughs> but it's better than it is in the actual anime. <laughs> oh. Okay, so how about you how about you tell me where the fuck is Riddy, huh? He became a politician after uh, the events of the Unicorn. It's like one year after this, isn't it? No, it's doing yeah, the GPO3 sure thing. It's sitting inside of its armor, shooting its rocket launchers. You can't launchers. be a fucking politician yet. This is only like one year after. Yes, after all the guys died, that guy died really hard, I get it. Alright, he's out of sub ammo, so he just purges it, and then he's like, fuck it, I got like eight arms. He doesn't know how to purge properly. Yo, fuck Charlie. I hate shit like this. They're at that part in the movie where they're like, they're kind of mm, we kind of, of, yeah, we kind of misjudged our budget, so we're gonna slow a couple of these shots down in post. Oh yeah. god, just to stretch it out. We gotta make stuff happen. Oh god, what, what are we doing? All right, K-pop full frontal's feeling himself though. Like. I'm, I'm, I'm confused as to how that guy has any fucking authority in anything, but okay. Um, don't worry about it, you're asking too many questions. I think he's basically operating independently at this point. Yeah, yeah but I mean, like, how did he even have the, the, the rank of lieutenant in the first place? <laughs> when I saw this the first time, I thought this was, like, the tightest shit. Because it was just so pretty. And that was basically the only reason. Uh, Oh, they the tightest really shit. Like the tightest shit has not happened yet. That's the space suplex. You'll understand. Oh, you no. Like I, I kind of feel like they, they had. Okay, like hot take. Like I'm kind of feeling so far that like they were like, shit. We don't have like anybody else left to do a fucking villain. Or we already fucking like technically bought Shar back from the dead to be a villain. So who the fuck can we even use? So like they, they just have this like this crap instead, basically. You're just out of ideas. No, like, I'm gonna be real, K-Pop Full Frontal is actually the worst, but I feel like the potential for him is so great. And that's why I call him Gundam Darth Maul, is that the concept of him is fantastic. But in this movie, I hate the way he's executed. <laughs> because he's just not he's just, done well. He just, he just not, he just really not, like... He's a non-character at this he, point. Just an edge lord. That's really it. That's his trope. He's just edge. Like, wow, he has one fucking eye and a cut. Oh my god, he's so edgy, bro. They're not, not even looking at the obvious. fucking like. Okay, no, so like the leading. I was like, I was watching this the first time, right? And I'm like, ma'am, this is too edgy. Like, like, they, they, like they, they, I come from Double O, and there's some the edgy shit in Double O, but this is like too much. I don't know. Okay, I in mean, fairness, though, you like seed. I can't trust your taste. <laughs> wow! Oh, told you, I like you had a brief moment where you like Providence Gundam, and that's what made you want to use it in Versus. Because hey, you like Rao. nothing wrong with that. I, I'd I mean, like to report like. a murder. <laughs> Tess, you don't understand. I thought Rao was cool until like... Rao is cool. And so Rao I tried cool. using Providence Gundam, and you said that, great, this is not a scrub... You can use this. Oh my god. And then I watched Seed and I was like, oh, this is sucks. And then I watched all of it because Enrique was like, you need to watch Seed Destiny. And so I watched oh it and god. it was. I never liked the series as a whole. Oh my god. I don't know where you got this idea from. Man, I like Shin Asuka for a little while. I like Seed Destiny. I, not I do like Shin Asuka as well. I no, like to actually for a just like while. Destiny. I, I like Sinoska for a little while until I stopped <laughs> liking him when he became a not character. He suddenly became very unlikable. Oh, that's a mood. <laughs> when he just became a non character. I mean, I already cool. told y'all, man, like, I love 
shit, Asuka unconditionally, even though we need to try to do the dumbest shit because I hated Kira Yamato that much. When Destiny was like. Destroyed, the moon. <laughs> when Destiny was destroyed on the moon, and uh, she and Asuka was crying with Luna Maria, I cried with them. Oh fuck, my eyes are two different colors. I am a character. Oh, fuck, oh badass. Oh, also, oh fuck. Test, you Who do I wrong. gotta pay to get heterochrome? The only test, the only... I was gonna say the first... The only reason I want to purchase seed in the first place is because the English voice actors are and the Catherine are the same. That's the only reason I watched seed. Oh my god, the, the, wait, are the, the fingers are like Itano Sarkis, oh my god. Oh man, yeah, that's no, literally no. me when I'm playing Dragon Ball. I know what I want. Oh, I know. oh my god. Oh god! Oh, I found it. Here. Uh... Fucking K-pop oh, oh my god. He's popular with the ladies. Wow. I'm you, he just needs a fan cam, bro. Yeah, like, something I've been trying to say for a bit. One of my problems with this fucking K-pop... One of my problems with K-pop Hall Fondo is that, like, they, they actually bother to do any fucking, like, backstory for, like, these... Ex these... These cyber new types, right? Like mm -hmm. the, the main trio, yeah. but they just mm -hmm. haven't even bothered for him. Yeah. They're like, you know what? Fuck exactly. Nope. Yeah. Like, there's yeah, that's kind of the issue. I'm having there for that character, but they don't do anything with yeah, it. Yeah, like the the theme I, is all here in the I, movie, I, and it's just like totally missed. Like they have, like no kind of backstory other than they were friends. What a different. They have an hour and a half to work with. They don't make they it. Do. All right. You're right. It's kind of like it's kind of like what happened. Uh, I hate to use this. What happened, uh. Uh, in Kingdom Hearts, uh, three six days, whatever, and Ooh. like they had the trio, and they had a really, you know, and you know, they had a really good backstory and shit. But at, we, at the end of the day, <laughs> uh, so what you're know. telling me is that Yona needed to share some fucking sea salt ice cream with the Federation. That's exactly what is happening. Every time I see it, I'm like, they just need to sell this with sea salt ice cream and just get the you fuck right. Off. Well, fuck right. issues they have, they just need to get the fuck over with sea salt ice cream. <laughs> Yona just needs to look at the phoenix and be like, got it memorized. <laughs> got it memorized. Oh, I got it. Oh, I got this. Oh, say that. What, what, I thought he's, 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 he's piloting it right now. Why is, why are they going? I'm, I'm so confused. They're yeah, me too. Going to, uh, well, uh, where, uh, what, what, what uh, the club? Young is fighting Phoenix. But they're talking about they need to get in the narrative, but it's like, wait, but, but Yona's already in the fucking narrative and he's fighting her right now, what, what's going on? No, they're no. trying to get the spare Psycho Frame parts to narrative. Oh, okay. Yes. So that they can make it the narrative Type C. Technically, it's already a Type C, but they want to just give more Psycho Frames because fuck the super Type C. Did that before it left. Uh, they didn't have time, probably. Yeah, so CCA's pacing is actually godlike compared to this. It's really like, cause like CCA isn't bad. It's just the pacing was fucked up. But it was like I still enjoyed it. This no, no, CCA was bad. Because it had a... CCA was bad. I'm oh my god. It's good is because she died. Oh my god. The reason CCA is good is because you had two other things to give you context. No, the, the, the old, nah, like, I feel like I the old- I didn't have any context watching CCA. Okay. <laughs> no, I didn't- even... You do have context before you watch CCA, which is like- I had no context. I guess? Context, what? like, at all. The context I was- like not having, no, back. I feel like not having context for CCA, I enjoyed the movie more than I, I thought it was. Because I was so invested that Quest had to die, I was just so elated <laughs> when actually happened. Oh my god. That's such a good take. Holy shit. I'm kind of, I'm kind of, I'm kind of, I'm kind of the same. Such well. a big brain take. <laughs> Listen, Look, I didn't have any context for this movie, is, but I Quest has right? to Who fucking die. Anyways, I was like, alright, listen. So like, I don't know anything about like, Char and Amuro, right? But I was like, so like, Amuro was going in. And they're right, and I'm like, he's apparently dating his woman. I was like, doesn't he already have a different And then Char goes to this colony, is like, oh, I gotta go tell Amuro I'm here. And I'm like, are they dating? Oh my god. They're gay! The invaders were less about this is a good song. Some fucking magic bullshit. It's like. Like, they're just enhanced.
Oh god, that's his assist. That's a super right there. Yeah. That's literally that's a super. That's a super. That's the next step. Oh fuck. I don't know, at least the show tried something. It's... That's something that mustn't exist in this world. I'm still waiting for the time trap. I'm still getting a credit for I'm getting a Oh. Yo, check it! It's your unicorn boys. Yeah. The guy, the ship guy. blow up. Uh, this is the oh, new model. Oh, I forgot my second favorite part of this movie. It's a new model. You're a new model. Got oh my god. Oh. Wait, wait, is that bad? Is, is that, that, is? Is that bad? Is it? EGMF Testament yes. is about to evolve into EFSF Testament. Wait, oh is in this <laughs> Banager is in this fucking movie. What the fuck? Yeah. Hell? yeah. <laughs> I also love this. Whoa! Banana hammock? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh my god. <laughs> Who the fuck's banana hammock? Oh. Wait, what the fuck? Why, I thought you wanted to control it. I'm confused now. What the? No, self sacrifice. Let's go. Psycho frame, guys. Psycho frame! Okay. Okay. Wow, this pacing is terrible. Yeah. I, I know. I know. Like, it just goes from zero to like a hundred and back to zero. <laughs> I like how Jack's not even in the chat, but he just saw what. <laughs> he just knows what happened. He just knows. <laughs> I thought you wanted to get that thing's fucking power. Like, I'm so confused. What are your motivations now? Well, now you the You're telling me this whole time so, you're actually, like, actually, like, only in it because you wanted to save your friend. like, no, you can't have the power yet. <laughs> Yo, K-pop full frontal piloting reborns would be the biggest glow. No, 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 no. no it's, uh, like, just psych. You thought this person, like, hated her friends and everything and just saved herself, but no, actually, she was trying to be good. The whole time. <sighs> I'm, I'm not sure they really built up to that reveal properly. <laughs> no. Well, to be fair, it's also kind of hard to pay attention when, like, uh, we're all talking about it as well. I think it's good if they just, like, we watch this I think later they on. did that in, like, one scene, though. I'm sorry. I'm sorry? Even when I watched this movie raw, with, like, not having to deal with conversation, a lot of those movies... Yeah. <sighs> See, like, I feel like these scenes would have had more impact from, uh, Zoltan if we replaced some other scenes in the movie with more info on him. Just make the whole movie about Zoltan. <laughs> so, <laughs> what I'm so, what I'm learning from watching is, like, like, give me Densetsu no Zoltan and I will pay, like, a hundred dollars. I don't even understand what his motivations are right now. So, what I mean, I'm learning from you is... spell it out, is, like, yeah. uh, what is it? He hates what he is, and he hates, like, humanity for making him what he is. So he's just Rao, basically. A better Rao, yeah. A better Rao? I'm sorry, Rao's better than this. Rao's better than him, man. Rao had a backstory. Uh, Rao had a no, backstory. Oh my god. Rao had a backstory. Rao has, has, like, I don't know how Rao's, like, Rao's like backstory is better than this. Oh, Rao has There's a backstory. one flashback episode of Destiny that, like, makes him into a real character. His backstory is that he's a clone of Neil Armstrong or some shit. And, like... Of Neil Armstrong? It's <laughs> close Dude. enough. Let Tess have it. How is that, like... <laughs> like, Tess got mixed up with that fault line as well. Look, how is that... <laughs> Like, better than, like, this being a fail for fucking clothes. No, no. Well, like, see, I'm he just... wasn't a failure. The line, if you don't shoot, you'll be stripped naked, is a great line out of yeah, context. Yeah, I agree. If you don't shoot, you'll be stripped naked. What? What did they mean by- Yeah, ma'am. This man's name is Brick. I forgot. Yeah. Who names their child Brick? Who names a child Ben? Like, what the fuck am I out of here for? Who names a child Camille? That's a girl's name. Oh, my oh God. got him. Your name's Monkey D. Luffy? Yeah, my parents hated me. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to save the day, I guess. Oh, my. 
Oh, see what you, you say is well. To be fair, my dad named this Monkey Big Dragon. So is it zoom into the cockpit? Cause it's like, oh guys, more screen time for Neo's Young, please. <laughs> <laughs> All I'm learning for this is that Gundams don't need to be. Alright, these two are gonna make out, right? No, no they're gonna die. Oh, they're holding hands. It's fine. That's basically the point. So, like, you're actually like, just gonna be the glasses. Okay. Guys, he's gay. He, like, 100% says that. In he's saying no! Ginger, <laughs> <laughs> no! That man verbatim is like, I am not attracted to women, which is why I'm allowed to be close. Oh, no. Fair. She's shut up. <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> Ginger, no! I'm not a ginger. No, that's exactly what I thought. Thank you, Nate. <laughs> oh, no, my best friend died. How could this have happened? He's gonna go Super Saiyan. He's gonna go Super Saiyan, right? He's oh, he is. Is, is it time for me to get mad? Yeah, it is the barrier. Where's your last one? Where's your last one? Where's your last one? It drives you mad. The psycho frame is responding. You're cursed, too. Psycho frame is responding. What's the point? What's the point of all this? Just what am I fighting for? As fast as possible. The writers needed max CPM. Hey, man, we need we need uh, big characters to just feel sad for me. I just kill the main friend. Nobody cares. Wow, it's nice to know that even as a child, Michelle was shit. All right. Michelle would be the one that would be like, "Oh, that's the biggest piece of pizza. I'm calling dibs." But you didn't pay for the pizza. <laughs> Michelle goes to the dispensary and tries to get a discount ASMR. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> what do you mean I can't get a discount? What the fuck is up with the taxes? Why are they so high? Fuck, dude. Michelle goes to the dispensary and asks for the manager. Oh my god. I'm sorry, this quality of weed looking up my standards. Matthew, man. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I forgot the narrative gets fucked. <laughs> the narrative is so fucked! And it's not doing much worse than the RX-78. Oh, I mean, yeah. I mean oh, the RX-78. Oh, 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 Nick. Nick. Yep, it got to oh. four Nick. Jonah is escaping the rules of the yeah. narrative by escaping the narrative Gundam. I'm gonna punch you. <laughs> there we go. Escaping the narrative. Is that the fuck? <laughs> no, it's not it. That's not the unicorn. <laughs> Oh Nick. my god! Oh, Yoda doesn't give a fuck! Listen, Nick, anytime you come down, man, you can sleep on my couch. I will feed <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. There is oh my no god. one in it all. All I have to do no, is. I mean, I mean, that, that makes sense, to be honest. Yeah. Ghosts. So he just blew up a whole ass fucking, like, gun. Nah, man, nah, no, like, she. No. Oh, I. You know what was weird? Like, I knew that from, like. Like, I don't remember. Yeah. When I figured that out, but it was pretty early on in the movie. I don't remember when it was the first time. I've been keeping my mouth shut the entire time about that, honestly. So Yona's girlfriend became a bird, so he also became a bird. The bird. I see that he too no, is a fan of the key visual novel. From, like, year. She's been dead, like, yeah, the, yeah, no, she's been dead since before, like, the start of even going proper, I think. Yeah. So like, what is the Gundam call that uh, K-pop cars uh, like? Uh, Sinanji Stein. Okay, that's Sinanji Stein. Okay. Yes, the Sinanji Stein, and he's it's, in like, the Like, what you're looking at right now is technically, it's like, it's sitting in a big mobile. The Sinanji Stein is like, if you look where the head is supposed to be on the big mobile armor, there's like a little mobile suit in that head spot. And that's the Sinanji okay. Stein. And it, <laughs> I forgot that happened! Holy shit! Oh my god. There it is. <laughs> fuck. Wait, what the fuck? This is just. That man just got destroyed! 
Oh titles. my Who god. Fatality. I fucking hate this movie. Why did y'all make me watch this yeah, shit? Man. Oh my god, Jamal, why do you hate it? Maybe I need to Remember y'all, you love when a whole ass gun and it's just so through your intestines. Yo, <laughs> you ever been fisted by a fucking phoenix? <laughs> it's just me. No, it's, it's my favorite part. Dude, part. It's my favorite part. Yonasan, own a guy, fist me with your Gundam. Banasha's <laughs> Gundam has so three little arms. That, right? yeah. No, this that. pastel color palette. Ah, oh, go back. No, go back. Fuck. Banasha's in the Gundam with arm replacements. Yeah. Ah, uh, Banasha, please done. fist me with your Gundam. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> man knows what he wants. I don't want to think about that. Man. Look, if I'm gonna be murdered by a coronavirus anyway, I may as well go out with, by getting fisted by a Gundam. Man, we're trying to watch this movie and forget kid? about that. That's the, that's the young uh, guy who just died. I forget his name again. Oh, that was him? Brick. Yeah, that was Brick. Yeah, but you know, no, 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 you know what I noticed like the first time when they don't explain this? He kind of looks like a miniature Camille in that one shot at the end. And I'm like, but why? I mean... That's just like how young dudes with fluffy hair look. With the same color? <laughs> oh my god. I mean, look, he went gray. He went through a lot of fucking stress. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see how gray Obama went? He went yeah, man, he went gray. so great. Even his tie, like, did, like, as he said. Oh, wait, like, that I'm might surprised that by the time be Obama that. wasn't done, he had, what? like, heterochromia and scars. And, like, man. somehow had a third arm. <laughs> that wasn't his arm. Fuck. Is it time for my favorite shot that never gets explained? Yes. Oh, no. Is this symbolism? No, not this no. one. It's after. What's that? I wonder what I mean, shot you're about. It doesn't need an explanation. It's pretty, like, obvious what it is. No, you'll understand. This isn't the scene. Yeah, I, I saw know. Victory Gundam. I remember this. I know, I know, I know, but. Alright. Catch me to calm down, man. <laughs> Look, guys, it's the unicorn. I didn't express my appreciation for the shot with the wings the first time. Oh, wait, it's actually the but, unicorn. Like, really like it. It makes uh, like a wait. Yes! There is it? <laughs> okay, hang on. There is a perfect explanation for this. No, there is. Wait, I wait, just wait, thought wait, it was wait, a what? metaphor the first time. I love it. What? What? It is what? a metaphor, wait. and I love it. What? Wait, okay, I was about to say, this, this, cause I, I'm lost again. I'm about to say, cause I'm about to say what? Suplex? <laughs> <laughs> it's truly a bewildering thing! That's wait, the whole what? movie! Very, what? very, oh what God. is your shot? Are we almost over? I'm like 20 seconds behind yeah, the Yeah, we're almost pass. over. You'll understand. I, don't, I don't understand what just happened there. I have to, I have to <laughs> think about that for a second. And I'm not sure I'm gonna close Barry, it. there's a lot of concerning shots. You're gonna have to specify which one it was. I'll say after, it's fine. It's All right. truly a <laughs> bewildering thing. <laughs> Listen, Gundam by itself is truly a bewildering thing. I don't know what oh you want. Oh my god, it is not Double bewildering. Say I don't know. Listen, Double say the face you listen says. Because you have like every single gun in fact neatly stored in your brain doesn't mean everybody else does. Oh my god, just pay attention to the show. It, they perfectly explain things. Alright, where can I buy a fucking plane ticket to Texas? Yeah. No, okay. They, they need salt, so they, they fly around looking, looking for salt. Yeah, exactly! Listen, they need salt! Listen. Listen, Gundam. listen, okay, so wait, you're, you're, the case you're trying to make to me is that Gundam eventually perfectly explains everything, right? No, it's the that they need salt. White base no, ran no, out of salt. salt. Oh, like, no, oh, my no, second look, favorite scene. banana hammock. I didn't hear anything Chest said at all. <laughs> Sorry. It's coming up. Oh my god. Chess, will you answer the freaking question? I'm trying to let people watch the movie. <laughs> Christian, unrelated question! <laughs> oh my god. Just let him watch the movie. It'll be fine. Just trying to watch the movie. God damn! <laughs> Why did I not record this? I'm a fool. Oh, I did, don't worry. Oh, oh my there god. it is! Oh, okay. The squat! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Word. 
That's all I was here for. All right. Oh, okay. So <laughs> Why is the silver bullet like the coolest fucking suit? It actually kind of is, isn't it? I like it a lot. Like everything Bonagra pilots is just straight fire. <laughs> he only pilots like two suits, dude. Exactly, but they're exactly. all straight fire. It's okay. not over okay. yet. Okay. Everyone right. has to become right. friends. Can, can, can I ask a question or is it, or, or is there things? Go for it. Yes, yet. Go for it. Are there important things in the credits, though, or no? I mean, this is really it, like... Okay, because, like, okay, I, I, go, I, I don't know if I can rewind or whatever yet. I don't know if it does that until I can... I like, think actually. you can. We what probably have to wait until, like, we see the full end of the credits. And after the full end of the credits, we gotta see that same trailer for uh, Hathaway's Flash that we've seen for, like, a year and a half. Okay, well, it's either way, trailer I'm test. still, I'm, I'm kind of slightly confused as to why it, li why it literally turned into the unicorn at the end before it took them all away, and I'm like, I, I guess I kind of get why, but I'm also slightly confused. So I'm like, Look, I'm wait. too drunk to answer. I thought it was just like, you possibly wait, have. what? Was what was the question? Like, you were asking if it turned into the unicorn? Yeah. Like, I was like, wait, what is like, is, is that, okay. Okay, so basically, okay, no, 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 like, no, 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 like, okay, wait, like, I, I might have to go rewatch the fucking scene because I got confused. Like, wait, when did he get out of the fucking thing? Like, when, <laughs> when he care of it? Like, when then he, he turns around and he's looking at the unicorn, and then it's not the unicorn anymore, and then, and then, and then, no, 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 no. Uh, like, the color, color, okay, because of the scene. lighting, the color looks a little bit weird. But if you pay attention to the V fan, you'll see that the Fenix uh, spat him out and gave him to unicorn. And basically, like, the whole uh, thing of it is this. It's like, Fennec is like a guardian of the other world, and he <laughs> gave it to I'm Unicorn, sorry, who is the guardian of this world. No, I'm like, I think, no, 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 I think his question Wait, is dealing with, like, no, both. Time out. No, I, I'm, 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 I'm not talking about the symbolism. I'm trying to, like, follow up, like, uh, the fucking, like... It showed earlier in the up. movie the Fennec was able to open its cockpit on its own, so it yeah. could have, like, ejected him. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, okay, that's what I mean, so like, okay, the Fenix forcibly ejected him into fucking thing, and then, but then the unicorn picked him up, and I'm like, isn't the unicorn, like, pinned in, like, the safe thing? Just, that was like, metaphorical. That However, was metaphorical. However, Benadryl grabbing him by the ribs Okay, okay, so that's what I thought. Okay, that's, that, okay, that's what I thought. It's like, they just, it's like, oh, it's the unicorn, except it's actually just Benadryl and the silver, like, okay, okay. Yeah. And then Benazir just suplexed That's what I thought. That's what I thought. And tossed his ass in the face. I'm not crazy, basically. Yes. So... My so favorite scene is when Benazir just fucking grabs him and throws him in his face. So I have a, so I have a question. I have a question. So, the Fanix, it, was it just like... <laughs> Gundam or whatever? Like, what the fuck was it? It's the third unicorn. <laughs> There is yeah, the third unicorn. Unicorn. Third unicorn. Okay, so the backstory behind the Phoenix is this. Oh, uh, right, I'm gonna go brush my teeth now. <laughs> All right. So the Viz Foundation <laughs> made the unicorn, and then the Banshee was basically like, uh, what is it? Another one by the Viz Foundation. But the Federation got pretty salty because they gave Viz Foundation resources and research to make the unicorn, but they didn't end up with Unit One or Unit Two. So they made their own uh, unicorn, and that's Unit Three, Phoenix. Uh, uh, and the hive electronics are a bunch of fucking. Okay. Oh, I, have, I have the next question. Okay. Go ahead. So like, I thought the whole thing with the fucking Arg Zero series was like the fucking Laplace box set. So I guess the FedEx had nothing to do with Laplace box. Though, right? Correct. The Laplace box is only a program that was installed in uh, the first Unicorn, and that's only for something. Um, that's only to find out where the Laplace uh, box actually is. Okay. So the point of the movie was them trying to uh, capture the Neo Zeon, right? Uh, they no, want to blow no, up the trailer, Neo Zeon. No trailer. There we go. It's over. Okay, never mind. No Wait, so they want to blow up that big ass fucking Gundam? Is that what it was? Basically. Yes. Okay. Because it was made with technology from another world. Yeah, it didn't belong oh, there. Oh my fucking god! Did they really say that? Yeah. Yes. What world? <laughs> what world? <laughs> Don't worry <laughs> about it. No, hold on. I'm worried about it. What oh, world? That bitch. So they play Doom, and they're like, yo, this demon technology is pretty cool. Yo, coming soon. Yo. Okay, I'm, and I'm, then, I'm... And then Hakurei Reimu is like, I'm gonna make a Gundam. 
And that's how you get the the psycho frame. Okay. The psycho frame is just Don Maku. It's the yin yang orbs. It's definitely it's just the yin yang orbs. And then fucking Marisa is like, I'm gonna throw the mini Hakuro into this fucking mech. Yeah, I think I, I okay. My over, I think like my evaluation on watching that movie is that well, okay, obviously the pacing is kind of fucked, but Nick, Nick's right. Most Gundam movies have bad pacing, except the Double O movie. The Double O movie is perfect. Fuck double O you. movie is good. Okay, but the the I'm I feel like this is gonna sound maybe like uh, overly critical because, but I don't know what you guys think of it. But like, because like to me, this is like I kind of feel like. For a move like for a movie, like it, it, the it, it feels like there's like too many things to like they're 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 good ideas, but then it's like all kind of like getting lost in the in the sense of like oh well this has to be like a weird fucking sequel to Unicorn Base. And I'm like this could have totally been like its own fucking just Gundam thing, right? Like with it having that a was fucking like when I just read it, I'm like yeah. I can at least respect that it tried things, but. I don't think it was best place trying to crib UC moments and symbolism because it really had nothing. Yeah, yeah it, it just I doesn't feel, work, and it just makes I it more kinda, confusing. Yeah, I kind of feel the same way as Irisa. Like, I'm probably also probably overly critical because maybe it was going on, but I feel you like see, I it was the whole not movie, doing. But you're not wrong. No, like I feel like I feel like. If it didn't have all that uh, shit it was trying to tie into the UC, and it was just his own thing, it would be fine. But it caught, it wasn't, and it just left me all like confused and shit. Like, what? Jamal, I promise you that I'm not what? being bitter about that. this, that I'm not like uh, taking it too personal that y'all don't like Gundam and T, but fuck you. He's lying. He's lying. I mean, I love you, Jamal. I'm going to tell you fine, something. Tess. I love you too. No, I'm, kidding, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Now, for real, though, Jamal, you did skip out on the first 30 minutes. It's only a third of the movie. Would the yep. first what could he have possibly would the missed? first thirty minutes explain anything? Yes. Yeah, you get yes. to see a dude get Are stepped you on. Sure. You Test. I think Stargazer was better than this. Like way better. Now, if I you know want thirty minutes, I don't have an argument against that. Okay. Like, I, I feel like these are actually quite similar. Like this and Stargazer are kind of similar. This is just like less. Like Stargazer is just less over the top, basically. Stargazer yeah. good. You'll, you'll, I like also, uh, Jamal, there, there's like a hilarious tweet that I want to show you. Hang on. Yeah. I'm sending it to you because it's a pretty fucking like stupid ass tweet, but yeah. Oh. Yo, did it start over? Oh no, I just went on to the English one. No, that's okay. Also, like, I'm all, I'm probably gonna have to go like with the sound off, look at some key fucking lines again because like I'm I'm a little bit mystified on what the conclusion's supposed to be, so I have to go double check that. So we'll be right back. Yeah, I'm kind of the same. I'm probably gonna have to just rewatch. That's all good. Well, there's always tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, there's always tomorrow. When watch Tom the English Crew watches it. Tomorrow. Mm. Um, I thought that a lot of the voice actors did a pretty good job. I agree. Did we see the English one? I don't know. I did. It was alright. Fucking, this man ignores me every time I ask him a Wait, what's up? fucking question. <laughs> In the theater, did we go see the English one? Yeah, we did see the English dub. Okay, because I didn't remember. Hmm. I'll probably watch the basketball. Man. Jamal, did you look at my DM? I did. Why, that is an old fucking uh, oh, okay. post. I've okay, seen that mind. before. It's okay. still fucking terrible. It is terrible, yes. What's terrible? Don't worry about it. You don't want to know. So do I still have to fly up to Texas to punch ZGMF? Oh yeah, Working 100%. Yes. Oh, yeah, 100%. One hundred percent. I don't even know about that because Destiny helped somewhat. I mean, I feel like the train wreck factor of Seed made it more worth it than that, personally. <laughs> uh, you had mm. eye candy in this. You had eye candy, but also like. Yeah, there's some train wreck factor. The train wreck factor, in my opinion, makes Seed just fun to watch. Mm. 
Like, I feel like overall narrative just is very forgettable. I just. <laughs> I think it's okay, Tess. I don't know. I don't know Thank you. So You're my only friend here, Coconuts. Like, is giving his opinion. As just Tess has this, like, old man, like, grunt where he's like, uh, don't agree. And I'm about to give you, like, the old man speech on why you're young and that your opinion is wrong. And that's just the f- feeling I got from that. Wait, is, is Test older than me? Yes. Probably. Because <laughs> I'm 27. Oh, yeah, no, he's older than you. Fuck. Test does not look like that old, though. He does I'll not. Like no. <laughs> Test looks like he's 25. I'll take it. <laughs> Tess does look very, very good for his age. Tess is just a good boy. I'll take it. (laughs) I'll take it. Listen, listen, I don't need to- listen. You have no right to comment, Tess, because you thought I was fucking 20. How old are you? You sound like you're 20. I am definitely not 20. Thank you, Jamal. You sound like a fucking baby. Have a great day. Yo, okay, listen, okay, Jamal, so- I sound I'm 20, but Tess is in real life. <laughs> <laughs> We're not talking about Gundam anymore. What are you, oh, what are you 